Hey, and welcome back to Retro Battle Play Spyro Episode 2. And just for this beginning part, I'm going to have to fast forward just for some brevity because the last episode was longer than I wanted it to be. And so seeming as this is seeming as this isn't too hard of an area to find all the gems, I'm just going to fast forward through it. So, be right back. Alright, so as you can see I just collected everything that I had to collect and that's taken me up to 17%. That's pretty cool, so there was 200 gems and 3 dragons and 1 dragon egg. And yeah, so now let's just run into some level. Let's go into Cliff Town, I guess. I wanted to go into a different level actually, but oh well, we'll start with this one. It doesn't make a difference really. Alright, fuck you. So, uh, it turns out that Spyro, he can't actually fire breath metal, which is kind of lame, but suppose it makes some sense. Yeah. Okay, so there's actually some gems around the side of this place. There's also some towards the back, and it took me a while to find those, but I figured it out in the end. So right here, you actually m make sure you flame these parts, otherwise you're missing out on some gems. And yeah, alright. Fuck you, fuck you too. Get that shit too. Alright. Toppers. So I have to apologize for the last episode, that was way longer than I intended it for it to be. Like, that was twice as long as what I was hoping. So I'm really gonna try to speed along this episode. And let's just free that dragon. Rescued Halvor. Alright. How's a dragon supposed to flame metal armor anyway? You can't. Remember Spyro. Flame won't harm metal. But charging with your horns. Yep. That should do the trick. You know that. I wonder what Spyro looks like when he's like an adult. I don't know if that's been revealed or not, but if it has, I look forward to finding out. Oh gosh, where are these faggots running to? Oh, god damn it, hit him! Hit that shit! Oh gosh, I just tried to flame him, that was dumb. Alright. Oh, dragon feed, come here you little shit! Oh, oh shit, he duped me a bit. Ah, I got your ass. Yeah, where you going, bitch? Where you going? Ah, oh, damn it! Can't get this little faggot. So much for speeding along, huh? Bam! That's my egg, bitch. Bing! All right. Uh, just trying to follow some sort of structure so I know where I've been and where I haven't been. There seems to be some gems there. Make sure I get those before I forget. Uh, and there is some stuff. No, we're here. What am I doing? Fuck you! Uh, grab these emerald looking gems. The gems look so nice. I love old graphics. Everything just looks that much more nicer sometimes. If that makes sense. Probably not. Shabam! I don't know what these are. I'm just assuming they're lives. They are lives. What am I saying? Yeah. I think they are just lives. There's nothing more to them than that. Ah, you slapped me. You faggot. Aha, glided back. Didn't expect that. Bam. 
bad. Oh gosh. I feel like I have a lot more control with this episode than the last. So I'm kind of proud of myself there. Boosh! Boosh! Ah! Ah! Okay. Whoa, easy now. Ba -ba bam Look at that. Fantastic control. Uh, okay, so to set this off, I mean to open it, you need to set off a firework, which I can't do at the moment. But you'll see. Hey, what's up? Turn the camera over here. Flame that. And grab a bat. And look at that. Rescued Enzo. Sounds like Ezio. Hey, what's on the other side of that river? It's close Why enough to the spelling. Alright. Calm, calm down. 21. Alright. Let's just slide on here. So there's the whirlwind to get you out the level. We don't want to go out the level yet because we basically got 100 more gems to get. So yeah. So he just suggested gliding across here and I'm gonna do just that because there's a bunch of stuff here as you can see. So I'll just make sure that I get everything here so I don't have to backtrack here again. And so on and so forth. It's actually not hard to get back here because they reveal a whirlwind for you later on to get back here. Should you ever need to. It's not so tedious. Alright. Flame on. Whoa, easy. Ah, oh, that vulture got me. Where'd he go? Little shit. Where'd he go? Fuck face. Flame on. And flame on. Okay, so these uh, represent the perimeter. So, gives you an idea of the amount of space you have. So it's not as big as you may think. That's what she said. Look at that, that's a fried turkey. Vulture. Uh, and I think that just about wraps it up. Right? Yep, looks good. And then there's a dragon free up there, and there is one vulture left. Let's get him, get that, and free him. Bam! Rescued Marco. Polo! You reach the highest point in Clifftown. Couldn't resist. You can get to almost anywhere from here. Mm, I mean, yeah. I'd use that whirlwind there. Ah, oh, nice one, lad. Okay, so this is the highest point in this level. So that's what you, what he was saying. May as well get these gems here. Whoa, easy now. Almost went a little too far. Now let's just whirlwind back up, because I wasn't quite done there. So this is the highest point. In fact, let's get those ones behind the starting point, because those are essential. So you go through here, and there it is. It took me so long to find these when practicing. It is annoying. But, got them in the end. Alright. Uh, now... Okay, <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying. Back up the whirlwind, I think. Because I think there are some more on the rooftops. Here from right. Yep, there are. So, oh god damn it. Let me get back. Alright, there we go. So, just get those. Uh, let's see if there's anywhere else that I may want to get. Anything else that I need to get. Fuck's sakes. There's a chest over here that I missed. So, right here, a whirlwind opens up once you reach the top. So, that that's good for convenience sake. And from here, there are some more chests, as you can see. You see that little firework? We're going to go to that first. That's the firework that we need to set up. So, bam. There we go. And that will destroy that chest up there. And I'll get, the, I'll get that momentarily. Not quite yet. Get these. And, ah! Well, that gave me an opportunity to get the chest that I just destroyed, so that was cool. The one with the fireworks, so I'll get that. And then we drop down here and get that. And it would appear that I'm missing probably like one gold gem somewhere. Let me just find it. Okay, so I missed one right next to the whirlwind. That was kind of annoying, but oh well. We got everything there, so now let's just return home. Bank that 400 gem treasure. Aw, oh, shit. That's something to be proud of, I guess. I don't know. So let's have a look at that. Pretty good, huh? Okay, so which level to go into next? Okay, I've decided that I'm going to go to Dry Canyon. 
and so I will. <laughs> He's such a cool little dragon man. Alright, let's kick some ass. Let's turn the camera here. Oh, that's kind of trippy. Just make sure there's nothing around here. And for once there isn't. I can't believe it. So just flame this thing. Destroy that. Get your lovely little ten to begin with. And fuck you, buddy! Ah, hit me. Didn't hurt me though. Bam, 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 bam. And let's go around here. Boosh, boosh. Oh, dragon thief! Come here, you little fuck. Spyro! Fucking asshole! You duped me somehow. Well, I got some gems. I'll deal with them in a minute. Let me get these little idiots. Bam! 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 Sweet! Okay, now where is this Joker? I think he's coming around here. Come here, you fuck! Bam, 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 bam! That's my egg! Bang! Fucking punk ass bitch! Bang! Okay, so there were some enemies around here, so let's get that. Get them even. Bam! Ow! Bam! As long as you're charging, you're basically invincible. So that's kinda cool. What are you doing, little punk? Oh, easy. Get him! Get him! Alright. Let's free that dragon. Forgot, that's kind of the main point. There you go, little guy. Rescued Conan. That's a Pokemon. Thank you for oh, no, releasing me. Actually, it might be. Is that it? Just a thank you? Well, that makes sense. Okay, let's go up here. Whee! And jump and destroy! Decimate! Obliterate! There we go. So he obliterates enemies. Now we know. Let's go over here. See what's cracker lacking. Okay, little entrance, why not? Cool. And get that. Oh, easy. Punk ass punk. Punk ass buster. Okay. This is pretty chill. This is a really good game. Ah, oh, that was awesome. Hey, another dragon. There you go. Rescued Ivor. It's got a Tristerostop. Tristerostop. Ah, I can't say that. Tristerostop. <laughs> I can't say that dinosaur name. Tristerostop. Tristerostop. Huh. I'm not even going to try that anymore. That's kind of embarrassing. It's like one of my favorite dinosaurs. But anyway, it looked like that dinosaur's head on a T-Rex with wings. That's what I can't say. I don't know. Bam! And... Uh. Oh, my Sparks is kind of dead. I like it when Sparks is blue. Sometimes I'm tempted just to leave him on blue. Which is kind of MLG if you think about it. Yeah. I won't though. Ow! Okay, now I don't even have Sparks, so definitely get him back. Oh well. I ain't gonna die. Do I ever? Alright. Got a good amount of gems. It's quite a big level. I think this is another one with 400 gems. Only they spread, a cr uh, spread out a little more. So yeah. Let's glide on over there. It just looks promising. Oh easy. Alright, let's glide along here. Some fireworks here. Let's set those off. Okay, back up because they will hurt you. And look at that. It's looking promising. Okay, destroy this stuff. Backtrack a bit. Flame that. And collect. So there's some chests over there, but um, I do believe you need a key for it. So let's get the key first. I'm sure it's somewhere. Uh, where could it be though? Flame on! You dead. Okay, an unexplored area. Let's be sure to explore. Another dragon. Okay, calm down Spyro. Look at him, he's crazy. Crazy guy. Spyro, please! God damn. Rescued Boris. 
My <laughs> canyon rewards good gliders. You are a good glider, eh, Spyro? Well, I duh. was born to glide. <laughs> Wait, does Spyro have eyebrows? They kind of look like they lifted completely off his face. It's kind of weird. I don't know. Okay, let's glide over there. And there is some stuff down there, but this just looked more hard to get to, so we may as well get to it. Look at that. I feel like the key might be around here. Uh, is it? Oh, I think I know what I have to do here. I think I got a glide quite far. Oh, yep, there we go. <laughs> Glad I remembered that, because that would have been tedious. Anyway, free up this dragon. Maximus. I mean, rescued Incredible Maximus. Glide, Spyro. I thought I'd be stuck here forever with those ugly vultures standing on my head. Totally, dude. Those birds might look tough. Don't point at your dick. They're pretty tasty. Why is he pointing at With a pinch of salt. <laughs> right. Cool, cool. Hey, there's the key. Kind of needed that, so that was good. Uh, now let's just go to the start area because there is some stuff here. Oh, I freaking nailed that guy. <laughs> that sounded gay. Okay. So, destroy that. And let's scurry along here and drop flame on. There's actually still some stuff on the ground that I haven't picked up. Okay. Flame! Ouch! You hit me, you little shit. That guy's not even attacking me. That's kind of weird. Maybe they have to be in a certain... I don't know. Proximity for them to attack you. Okay, so there are some gems over here, I do recall. Yep. Bam! Bam! Okay, get him! Boosh! Chill! Okay, yeah, look at that, that is a good amount of gems now. So let me get that key, uh, chest with the key. Okay, so from here, you just glide along, and there you go, you access the remaining gems. Makes sense, right? Flame this little thing, and yep, free up this chest. Okay, maybe not. I'll do that in a moment. May as well be the last thing to do. It just feels more right. Right? <laughs> Bong! And there you go. I think that racks them all up. Let's see. Yep, there you go. 400 out of 400. And yep, this level is complete. And I'm just going to exit the level like this, because it doesn't really matter, so long as you get all the dragons and stuff. So yeah, now let's... Hang on, let's just let that rack up. 2,000 gems already. Okay, so let's go on to the next level. Okay, so Ice Cavern is the next level that we shall go into. Why not? Look at that! 2,000 gems already, so that's like... Last episode, I got a thousand gems, and already we've got another a thousand. But that, you know, it kind of balances out with other levels, where there may be less gems, so it doesn't really matter. Okay, so let's get this guy. Bam! And let's hop on up here. Uh, what we got over here? I think I'm doing pretty good in terms of time this time around. <laughs> I'm quite proud of myself there. So yeah. We This level is quite big, I have to say. And it took me a while to find some of the gems, but I'm pretty sure I know where they all are now. So that's good. Practicing is very good in terms of making a video for you guys. Rescued Arlick. Word of caution. Arlick. Arlick. Wait what? until you grow big. <laughs> like me. And what Before is it with these cocky ass dragons who do fuck all with their lives? Just saying. So let's get that checkpoint and um, proceed to War Pass. They have to put a gem there, don't they? That's risky. Come on. Okay. So, yeah. Don't you throw that snowball. Because I will throw fire right back. Which is a lot more painful, as you just saw. Bam, 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 bam. And bam. <laughs> flame on. Flame on. Move your fat ass. Get this shit. And get this guy. Move! <laughs> and there's a dragon over here. And boom! Rescued Todor. 
Hey. Yep. And it took me so long to figure out how to get here, how to get them, because I was like gliding and shit. What you just gotta do is this, and it just falls on your head. Very simple, very annoying to find. But yep, that's what you do. Let's get that. There's some stuff over here, so let's get that first. Before I forget, and it's probably more convenient if we get it now rather than backtrack. So yeah. <laughs> Bang! Flying headbutt. Flying headbutt. <laughs> I love that. Ah! Gliding fail! Okay, so, yep. Ah, it turns out you need a key, so, nope. Have to backtrack anyway. Kind of annoying, but oh well. Let's fly across here. Jump. Jump. Jump, I say. Uh, let's go over here, get this, then drop down. BAM! And so yeah, those were like the armored norks, and because they're on ice, they can slip off the edge, so that's cool. But otherwise, you just flame them. But if they have armor, of course, you can't flame them. Makes sense. So you have to find like an environmental kill, like Sam Fisher would. Okay, so that's that. Uh, let's proceed to whoop more ass. Let's get this guy. Flying headbutt! Oh, no, wait, flames! There we go. <laughs> get that, get that, flame on, get that. Oh, come on. There you go. A life. Gonna want that. Gonna wanna want that. <laughs> okay, now let's free up this dragon. Rescued Andor. They're all a bunch of doors. Eh, short but sweet. Okay. And Hadouken! I sneezed on him and fire came out. And it killed him somehow. It's crazy. Ah, no. Classic Spyro, am I right? Am I right? Nope, not really. That was a classic fuck up by me. Get out the way, faggot. Alright. I'm not a homophobe, by the way. I'm just calling him a faggot just because I'm mean. Next time I'll just call him dickhead. How about that? So yeah. Bam. Oh, rescued Asher. No problem, lad. Thirty, the big free yo. Okay. So that's pretty chill. Um, yeah. There's a little secret passage around here, so make sure you get that. Just follow the gems. Oh, I missed some chests up over there, but I have to go back there anyway. That's fine. Throw this guy off the edge of glory. Glide along. Pick up some more gems. Huh? Huh? How about them gems? Get that. Ah, uh, bang! Ah, uh, boosh! <laughs> I'm a badass. Okay, and get that. Uh, yep, so there's some more stuff here. Let's get this guy. Let's get that guy. Whoa, easy now. Cool. So as you can see, once again, there's some gems on the pole. Make sure you get those. Be sure to get those. Oh. Yarp. Okay, so there's some stuff up there, but that's where we're going anyway. So that's fine. Just looking for that key, really. Get that shit. Jump this shit. Jump that shit. Fuck this shit up. Fuck you. And fuck you again. Cool. Look at me prancing around like a little pony. Bam. And rescued Ragnar. Or is it Ragnar? <laughs> oh, thanks. Are you my dad? <laughs> okay, so a little arrogant little spyro. Obnoxious little shit. Okay, I don't know what I'm saying. And let's get that guy. Wee! Move! Bang! God damn it. <laughs> okay. Get that shit. Oh, do that again, I dare you. Another life, sweet. 
So those clam things have to contain lives. So that's interesting. So the one thing that I couldn't figure out was how to get up there. And obviously those are free lives, but yeah, I just don't know how to get up there. So we're not going to go up there. And yeah, <laughs> that's that. Let's see what's in here. Oh, okay, return home. <laughs> so how many gems do I have? Wait, I still don't have the key. Interesting. Well, let's go over there because there are some boxes. I mean, chests. Sweet. I'm sure I missed something somewhere. I mean, I must have. Okay, so from here, where there were two gems on like a pole, there's the key. So be sure to get that. Now let me get back to the chest with the key. Hole. What? Okay, and there it is. Just pop that open. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. Don't even know why I laugh sometimes. And is that it? Hopefully it is. Let's see. And yeah, no. There's still something remaining. Yep, okay, so there was a little green gem here. But there you go. So I ended that episode, uh, this level in a similar manner to the last, where I just freed up that chest. And yep, there you go. 5 out of 5 dragons, 400 out of 400 gems. And now let's just exit this level. And yeah, returning home. Bank that stuff. The good stuff. The rich stuff, as I would call it, from the Goonies. I wouldn't call it. I wasn't in the Goonies. What am I saying? Okay, now the next level. Okay, so let's go into Night Flight. So it's another flying level, kind of like um, the last one in the previous episode. So that's pretty chill. Pretty, 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 pretty good. Let's see if I can do it in one go this time. Meow. Look at that. This one, I feel like, is a lot more easier, to be honest. Like, it, it is. It's just easier. It's kind of a more natural path. That was kind of annoying. I kind of just stopped there. So that might have messed me up. So, yeah. But we'll see. We'll see how it plays out. Bam. And that's two more chests. So get that. The reason why this one is easy, because you don't have to follow around like enemies and stuff. It's just kind of a more linear path in which you can just follow. And it's really not difficult. I say this is probably the most difficult part just because you kind of have to do a nose dive. But yeah, it's pretty easy still. Okay, so now you want to light up these lighthouses. Oh gosh. Do that. Uh, do some more of that. There you go. Bonk. And bonk. And I think there's another one here. Yep. Bam. Get this one. And there's the last one, so yep, there you go. It's not the best time ever, but I still did it. So that was that level, that was simple. Uh, no, I don't want to try again, because I did it, son. And it looks like we're already on the last level. I'm really proud of myself for doing it at such a good speed. Uh, so yeah. So, let's have a look. Look at that, everything. <laughs> um, so the last level's just here, so... No point skipping that. The guy's name is Dr. Shemp. Confronting Dr. Shemp. Total treasure. 2,700. Well done, Spyro. Okay. So... I don't remember if this guy was difficult, but he probably wasn't, seeming as I don't remember. Oh, easy now. Okay, so there's that enemy. That's kind of annoying. I feel like the walk up to the enemy, I mean the boss, is the hardest part. Just personally. But yeah. Oh, fuck's sakes, I keep falling for that shit. Urgh! What am I doing? Okay, I need to just ram him back. I need to, like, think a little more. Okay, so just pick up these gems that those people turned into. Get this chest, because I won't be coming back to... Well, I won't be backtracking that far. So yeah. And headbutt. And let's jump up here, and flame on. Flame on, okay. Come on now. Uh, pretty chill, pretty chill. Oh, fuck you. Okay, I almost died there, but my stupidity let me live. <laughs> That's kind of weird. So, stop throwing suicidal people at me. Arrgh. Ow, you slapped me, bitch. 
There you go. Uh, yep, gem. So, ha, you died. So I think there is a whirlwind. Yep, there is. It took me so long to find this whirlwind in practice. I don't know why, but uh, yeah, I obviously know where it is now, so that's cool. And there's a little purple gem over there, which is worth a lot, as you're going to see. 25. It's a big number. And let's get that key while I'm at it. Whoa! Okay, so yeah, most deaths are just going to be stupid deaths in this game, apparently. Uh, it's mostly just gliding deaths. But whatevs. So now let's proceed to whoop some more ass. Grab that shit. Free up this dragon. Rescued! Trondo. I know, right? <laughs> yeah, he should. Oh, that's a tip, actually, because you want to flame his back. <laughs> Cheeky little cunt. Couldn't just be more, like, obvious about it. Okay, so here's the boss. He's kind of a faggot. I mean, dickhead. Dickhead. And then you flame his back. Simple. He kicked me. Uh, any gems down there? I don't think there are. Uh, I'm just gonna go over here and just get the remaining stuff from here. Actually, I could have got that afterwards, but oh well. I would like to take the whirlwind out of this level. Bam! Okay, now let me get back. Oh, actually, I think I can just go back. Yep. Oh, no, I can't. Wee! Okay, so now let's take on, take him on again. What's he going to do this time? Oh, okay. Did he hit me? No, he didn't. Okay, do that again. I dare you. Ha ha ha, idiot. He did it. Man, you really need to armor your ass. That shit is hideous. Let's go up here, and... Bam! Simple. Another boss down. Another one down. And stacking up those gems. Those fat stacks. Um... I have to say, because I have to compare this game to Crash Bandicoot Warped, Crash Bandicoot Warped, the first boss in that is harder than both of these ones that I've faced so far, and there you go. I think that is the last of the remaining gems in this level. Yep, there you go. And can I just get back to the thing? Probably not, but I'll just do it while that's still loading up. I can't believe how fast you found so much stolen treasure! Yeah, you know that. Hop aboard for the Magic Creator's World if you are ready. It's Crafter's World. <laughs> okay. So actually, no, wait. Let me just stay here and let me just show you the progression. Look at that. Looking pretty good, huh? Already at a staggering 32%. So that's pretty awesome. So now let's actually go to the Magic Crafter's World or whatever. Crafters. Bonk. Whee! So I think my capture was messing, messing up towards the end there, so just had to sort that out. And yeah, so I hope I've kept this episode relatively short. Yeah, if not, I'll just cut myself out a little bit here and there. And whoa, this world looks interesting. Let's just find a dragon to free. Uh, okay, already got hurt. <laughs> oh, come here, you little shit. Okay, I'll deal with you later. <laughs> whoa, easy now. Back off. Okay, there's a dragon. So let's just free him and then I can save. Rescued Cosmos. Alright, so that's, that's it for this episode. So let me just save my progress. And so as always, I hope you liked it. And if you did, please do leave a like and fucking subscribe. I love you.